Okay, just as you thought feminism and the wage gap were dead, Audi brings out this lovely Super Bowl commercial that is so cringy and has gotten a very negative response, so I just wanted to respond to it. Roll the tape. I love how the boys in this video or the antagonists are like both fat. <laughs> what do I tell my daughter? What do you tell your daughter? Tell her she could do whatever she wants in life. She has the option and tell her that the wage gap is a myth and not to be a complete victim. Do I tell her that her grandpa's worth more than her grandma? Who would do that? <laughs> Who would say that your grandpa's worth more than your grandma? Who actually raises their kids like that? That her dad is worth more than her mom? Well, if the dad works more hours and makes more money, then technically, financially, he makes more, but that doesn't mean he's worth more in society than the mother. <sighs> Do I tell her that despite her education, her drive, her skills, her intelligence, she will automatically be valued as less than every man she ever meets. Uh, this is so not true. This is so annoying. I feel like I have more opportunities because I'm a woman these days. I do not feel like I'm at a disadvantage. I feel like we're even valued more. We're pandered to more in the media. We're like this special victim group. I'm so over it. More women are going to college and with affirmative action in certain careers, they will take a woman with less qualifications than a man because they want to get the woman in the job. This just makes no sense. Really tired of this regurgitating this opinion over and over again when it's just not true and it's been proved wrong again and again and again. They're just looking for social brownie points, virtue signaling points from SJWs. This is really pathetic, Audi. Woo, the girl wins, of course. Super shocked. Or maybe I'll be able to tell her something different. Tell her what? That she can buy an Audi? Tell her that she'll be a good driver? Because that's, that's just not possible. Everyone knows women aren't good drivers, but okay. Oh my God. Just as you think like social justice is over, it's coming to a close, feminism is dead, these advertisers make these stupid commercials, <sighs> pandering to minority groups, women, and it's just getting really, really old and tiring. And you can see from the ratings on this video, they're absolutely dismal. People are ripping this in the comments. It is just too funny, even on their Twitter. Let's read some funny comments. This could have been a great commercial 20 plus years ago. Tell her the wage gap isn't real. Did Audi just assume that child's gender are <laughs> free? Can women in Saudi Arabia drive an Audi? No. Never going to buy anything from this company as long as I live. Tell your daughter she'll be more successful under a Trump administration than a Hillary administration. So Audi, are you saying that you haven't been paying your female employees equally until now? Because if so, you've been breaking the law for about 50 four years now. Well, I'll for sure never buy an Audi now. On their Twitter, they tweeted, women are still paid 21% less than men. As a brand that believes in progress, we are committed to equal pay for equal work. What specifically have you done to address it? Action or feel good fluff? December 15th, on my birthday, we signed the equal pay pledge to commit to women's equality in the workplace. So before you did this, you paid your women employees 21% less? Audi, what is the source of your data? Hey Terry, please check out the US Congressional Study PDF to learn more. They respond, and you forgot to mention that all public companies are required to explain a 2.5% between genders. You pay your female employees less than males? You know that's against the law, right? <laughs> Audi. When we account for all the various factors that go into pay, women at Audi are on par with their male counterparts. You just explained away the wage gap that you claim exists. So exactly what are you supporting if it doesn't exist? <laughs> Good question. Audi. Your website lists only two women on your U.S. exec team and no women on your board. Does your commitment to progress stop at equal pay? <laughs> 
<laughs> Audi. We put to put aggressive hiring and development strategies in place to increase the number of women in our workforce. So instead of merit hiring will be based on genitalia, how progressive. <laughs> Audi, if what you say is true, why are only two out of 12 of your executive positions female? Audi. Audi has diverse hiring practices to ensure equality and pledge to increase the number of women in our workforce. They respond, nice politician answer. Still, if you promote equality for women, why are there only two out of 12 women in executive positions? <laughs> They're just getting shit on, and this is just great. The new, completely redesigned Audi SJW, specifically made for your everyday libtard, with extra room on the back for your overweight feminist friends, more cup holders for extra diet soda, bigger trunk size for your obnoxious man threatening, and other protest signs. Get them now while they last. <laughs> what do I tell my daughter? Tell her to buy a Mercedes. Can't wait for the Arabic translation of this ad. I own two brand new Audis. The first thing I'm doing tomorrow is selling them. <laughs> Are her parents Muslim? <laughs> What do I tell my daughter? Tell her if she wants to earn equal pay, she should get a degree in engineering instead of gender studies. This is the dumbest commercial ever. Thanks for helping me decide to get a BMW instead of an Audi. So yeah, uh, Audi, social justice, feminism is dead. Wage gap isn't real. Stop spreading nonsense and stop pandering to women. As a woman, I'm tired of it. Stop. Bye.